Hi, in this problem we're going to find the equation of the tangent line to the graph of this function, y equals one plus two x minus x cubed at the ordered pair one comma two. Let's go ahead and work through it, solution. So to find the equation of any line, we need a point and we need a slope. Because the tangent line and this graph share a point at one comma two, we already have the point, we simply need the slope. So we need the slope of the tangent line, which is super, super important. So the slope of the tangent line is the derivative of this function, and we want the slope at this ordered pair, so it's going to be the derivative of this function at one. By the way, you can think of this also as y of x equals all of this stuff. I wrote it that way, so now I can indicate what we want. The slope of the tangent line is the derivative at this x value, right? Super key. That is the central concept in all of this. So how do we find this? Well, we're simply going to use a formula. So y prime. So we're just going to take the derivative using just basic rules from calculus. So the derivative of a constant is 0, and 1 is a constant, so this is going to go away. The derivative of x is 1, and we have a 2 here, so we just get plus 2 times 1, which is 2. And here we can use the power rule. We can bring down the 3 and subtract 1. So this is minus 3x, and then you subtract 1 from the 3 squared. So y prime is equal to 2 minus 3x squared. So this derivative is the derivative of the function, and basically now this tells us the slope at any x value. Since we're looking for the slope of the tangent line at x equals 1, all we do is plug in 1. So y prime of 1 is equal to 2 minus 3 times 1 squared. So this is equal to 2 minus 3, because 1 squared is 1, and 3 times 1 is 3. And so this is equal to negative 1. So that is our slope. So now we have our slope, which I'll call m. And we have our point. And let's see what that was, 1 comma 2. I'm going to put this information in a box just so we don't lose it because there's a lot going on. All right, so now we're going to use a formula. So there's a couple formulas we can use. I like to use this one. It's the point slope formula. Y minus Y1 is equal to M parentheses X minus X1. So our X1 is 1, our Y1 is 2. So this is Y minus 2 equals m is negative 1 times parentheses x minus, and then x1 is 1. Let's just double check that. Our y1 is 2, our m is negative 1, our x1 is 1. Yeah, everything looks okay. And usually people solve for y, so let's go ahead and do that. So this is y minus 2 equals negative 1 times x is negative x, negative 1 times negative 1 is positive 1. Then we can add 2 to both sides, so plus 2, plus 2. So we get y equals negative x plus 3. And that would be the equation of the tangent line. I hope this video has been helpful to someone. Good luck.